How to turn a woman on. Warm your girl up. The key to turning a girl on is being patient. As fast as guys usually get turned on, girls, and some women, need about that much build up. This means that you'll have to lay a little groundwork and take the seduction part nice and slow. A huge part of warming her up, of course, is making her feel comfortable and safe. You're going to see a lot of steps below about respecting her, seeking consent, and otherwise doing things that you might not think of as turn-ons. Don't neglect them, they're important. Sex is very mental for many girls and women, and if you help them by making it so that they don't have to worry, then that's half the battle. Make her feel you find her attractive. You know that warm, fuzzy feeling you get when you find out that someone thinks you're good looking? That's what you want to create for her. The fact that you think she's lovely to look at is a significant turn on. Here is how to communicate it without going overboard. Say hey, pretty lady, or hello, beautiful, when you greet her. It's simple and short, but direct and potentially patronizing, use with caution. Pay her a compliment. Lower the volume and tone of your voice slightly, and say something like you look amazing today, or I love your eyes. 3. Be the best version of yourself. Be the person who's honestly kind, a person who respects her and thinks she's more beautiful than the most picturesque sunset. Be the person who works hard and makes it easier for her to work hard, by helping to shoulder her burdens. This will all mostly keep you from turning her off. Be confident, even if you don't act like it. Some girls like a guy who is nervous and even klutzy around her, but don't overdo it. If the girl is shy, be confident. If the girl is confident, feel free to act somewhat shy. Keep your shoulders straight and your chin high, and don't be afraid to look her in the eyes. You're communicating through your body language that you're strong, brave, and worthy of her attention. 5. Clean up. Shower, put on deodorant, shave, brush your teeth and wear clean clothes. If you're feeling up to it, you can also do your hair and put on a light spray of cologne. Knowing that you're at your physical best will help you act confident and in charge. 6. Know how to treat a girl like a lady. Save the dirty jokes and discussions of bodily functions for your guy friends. When you're with a girl you like, be polite. Use good table manners, hold the door open for her, and say please and thank you. Good manners aren't necessarily attractive, but bad manners are definitely unattractive, so play it safe. 7. Start with slow, gentle touches. You can do these in passing, at the end of a date, while you're watching a movie, whenever the point is that they don't have to be saved for when you're already making out. They can, however, indicate that you're interested in doing a little more. 8. Whisper in her ear. Ears are an aerogenous zone for both sexes, and the light pressure of your breath will probably feel good. Saying the right things will also turn her on. Try something like I couldn't stop thinking about you today. Give her an amazing kiss. If it's done right, a kiss can be the most effective way of turning a girl on. Keep your breath fresh with some gum or mouthwash and keep your lips loose. Tight, puckered lips is how you kiss your grandma. You should also keep the tongue action delicate at first. The motions should be light, soft and alternate between fast and slow. Know where to put your hands. The back of her neck, the sides of her face, or around her waist are all good areas for your hands to rest during a kiss. Tell her what you want. Many girls are way more sexual than you, potentially. Give them credit for that and there's nothing wrong with telling them how much you want them once you've gotten your foot in the door a bit. This actually turns them on. Think about it you feel turned on when you feel desirable too. Don't be really gross about it but don't be afraid to tell them how sexy you think they are and how you can't wait to get them in bed. Focus on more intimate erogenous zones. If you tried some of the suggestions above and she seemed receptive, here are some more intimate areas you can work with, using light touches and soft, slow kisses. Neck, throat, collarbones and shoulders. Feet and ankles. The small of her back toward the bottom of the spine. Back of the knees. Inner thighs. Ears. The inside of her upper arm. 